Alright, nothing fancy about the hardening. Get it up to the right temperature, quench it. This is 01, so I'm going to quench in oil. We want that thing hard. We don't need to temper it. Quite honestly, the 01 does spark when it's tempered, but in this case, we don't need to worry about it. Actually, there's one thing I like to do before I put that um, shape in. That's take the ball peen. Just give this thing some texture right on the edge. I can't distort the edge too much because I want enough of a relatively smooth striking surface to, to uh, generate a, a spark. But I like to rough this up because, again, sticking with the Viking theme. The center part of a wheel on a car is called a hub. The wheel spins smoothly because the hub has bearings inside it. Bearings reduce friction, which is a force that resists motion. A common type of bearing has tiny steel balls that allow the hub to roll around the axle instead of rubbing against it. Rolling produces less friction than rubbing, so having bearings in the hub will make it easier to start spinning and keep it spinning. Just get them out there like that. So there's uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine ball bearings. Now I just want to take one bearing at a time and drop it in the race and the grease will hold in place and there's my nine bearings I got a nice little circle around in there and just make sure they're pressed down into the grease like that and then they'll stay there All 
Alrighty, I'm gonna go ahead and punch that hole towards the top here somewhere, trying to make it centered. Ouch. That hurt. Well, I messed up. I'm gonna go back for one more. Alright, let's see if we can do this without messing up this time. It's cold out today, so my steel cools pretty quick. Right. This is just out of the quench. I haven't done anything to it yet. Let's see if we get some sparks. Hopefully you can see that. The sparks are flying off like crazy. So I'm going to uh, put a wire brush to this thing, clean it up. I'll string it on a lanyard and I'll come back and show you how it works. Alright guys. It's been a nice little leather lanyard. Looks really cool. Just kind of wire brushed that. I didn't do anything else with that. The uh, rune really looks cool. It'll look cool on somebody's neck. You can see I got